Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this problem? Square root of 2 root 3 root 4 equals to 8 raised to power x. From here, let's take the square on both sides. So we have square root of 2 root 3. Then inside the root, we have root 4. Then equals to 8 raised to power x. So we square this side and also we square this side. So from here we have square, we cancel this square root. Then what we have left we become 2 root 3 then root 4 which is equal to here. This power we multiply and we have 8 raised to the power 2x. Then in the next step also we also take the square on both sides. So take the square on this side and also take the square on this side as well. So here this square will affect 2 and it will affect this root. So 2 square that will give us 4. Then the square we cancel square root here that will be times 3 then root 4. Which is equal to also these two multiply the power we have 8 raised to the power 4 x and uh, in the next step we have root 4 to be 2 so we can say this is 4 times 3 times 2 which is equal to 8 raised to the power 4 x then in the next step we have 4 times 3 times 2 that we can give us 24 so we have 24 equals to 8 raised to the power 4 x and also we can factor it from this and there will be 8 times 3 which is equals to 8 raised to the power 4 x so is the thing as equally multiplying 4 times 2 then 4 times 2 that's 8 then times 3 then from here we can divide both sides by 8 so let's divide this side by 8 then divide this side by 8 so 8 we cancel it here then what we have here is 3 equals to from the law of indices we can write this as 8 raised to the power 4x minus 1 that is when we have a raised to the power m divided by a raised to the power n yeah, this is same thing as a raised to the power m minus n. So when we apply that, we have here. Then we can take the log on both sides. We have log 3 equals to log 8 raised to the power 4x minus 1. And applying the power law of indices, we take the power, which is 4x minus 1 here, to the back. So we have log 3 equals to... 4x minus 1 then log 8 and uh, in the next step we can divide both sides by log 8 to remove log 8 on this side so divide this side by log 8 and also divide this side by log 8 and here log 8 we cancel each other and what we have left here can be written as 4x so we can write it first 4x minus 1 is it that we write this side or this side see the same thing then equals to log 3 over log 8 we can change it and uh, from change of base that will be log 3 then base 8 then also we have minus 1 here we can take it to the other side and that will be 4x equals to log 3 base 8 then plus 1 then we remove this 4 here by dividing both sides by 4 then 4 we cancel 4 on the on this side then we have x now to be equals to log 3 base 8 plus 1 then all over 4 so here we have the solution to the problem 
and we can also we can also check from the equation given to confirm whether the solution satisfy the equation thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel see you in the next class and bye for now